Guys, you know, Bonner Boy performs on stage with colorful brass from his fans at a recent event, and that is all gone viral on social media. And the video is all out. What you need to understand about Bonner Boy is that, in terms of stage, you know, performance, Bonner Boy is far better than you know the likes of whiskey and Davido. That is something we are now confirming and uh, because Bonner Boy has raised the bar and uh, the likes of Timaya, Sani, they are all talking about that at a point like this. Um, before I proceed, I have some interesting stories to see, uh, kind of share with you guys on this and uh, you have to sit back, relax, go and check us out on other social media platforms. Subscribe, click the subscribe button below if you are yet to subscribe and then be a part of it. <laughs> Guys, let's kind of understand uh, ourselves a bit. Um, the lies of uh, Obi Kobana has come out to reveal his source of his money and trying to warn uh, people, to, um, you know, smearing his name and trying to like, you know, pollute his name at a point like this. And he said he has built his name over the years and that is earning a lot for him. And trying to like, you know, spoil the name right now is not going to work and is going to take legal actions against anybody that made such attempt. According to Obi Kubana, Obi Kubana reveals the source of his wealth says, I am not a drug baron and because people are taking him for a drug baron. And uh, Obi Kubana went further to say, um, you know, he is a legitimate businessman with verified interest in variety of industries and one that any attempt to smear his name will be met with legal action litigation and uh, that is coming in from Obi Kubana not everybody that is a rich guy is in a crime that is something I want you guys to understand at a point like this Obi Kubana has worked over the years for his name and for his money and let us or kind of respect him for that. Bonner Boy is one of the biggest name in the industry right now. Uh, Bonner Boy at Madison Square. Anytime I visit Nigeria, I get treated like a king. Thank you, Nigerians. That is coming in from Buster Rand, meeting up with Bonner Boy at a recent concert. And a lot of people are saying that Bonner Boy has raised the bar for us. And uh, I think we have to actually understand it from a different point of view and a lot of you need to understand this that man Bonner Boy is one big art in Nigeria and is proud about it and some people believe that Bonner Boy is too proud and all those kind of things but that is his nature that is something I believe over the years the likes of Timaya has come uh, uh, came out to say man Bonner Boy you know what Odogu unlock another level. That is what uh, Timaya is saying. After a kind of fantastic performance of Bonner Boy at the Madison Square in US, that is um, kind of um, you know interesting for us to understand. And people have started comparing the performance of Bonner Boy to that of Davido and Whiskey. And I believe that yes, Bonner Boy, when it comes to stage performance, Bonner Boy is far better than Whiskey and. Uh, you know that video that is something i believe about that because uh maybe his background actually played a role in uh, giving him the opportunities uh to learn it early beforehand and uh, uh the lives of uh, whiskey and david o, they are not from the music musical home that is what you need to understand at a point like this rick hassani nigerian singer has come out to say i hope everyone has been uh have seen bonner boys uh performance and i hope that uh that becomes the standard no 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 more nonsense and miming and yelling on stage please that's how to do it class odogu and uh, people are now saying that man indirectly uh this guy must be referring to the likes of uh, davido and whiskey and uh, because these are the big threes uh whiskey the video and Bonner boy and all those kind of things i don't want to say that i don't want to say a lot about that right now because it may be like i'm pitching it up on boy against the video whiskey and all those kind of things i don't want to do that but what i want to say is that nigerian artists they should go ahead and learn uh the stagecraft before you know doing such concerts because that is another way 
of raising your value that is what you need to understand whiskey made in lagos has now surpassed about 400 million streams on spotify it is the fastest nigerian album to reach its milestone and i think uh, whiskey is breaking record from time to time ever since his made in lagos album actually made it online and on streaming platforms whiskey is raking in a lot of money and a lot of numbers at a point like this and somebody came out to say i don't know how the video incorporates all these lyrics but man man said that i remiss i fit to buy you gold uh coma just see me uh leave this music team for davido i beg i think this is coming in from a davido's fan and uh, it's all uh, you know getting some people interested and uh, right now um singer Tem tenny is set to make a follower's dream come true as she foots her bills to dubai that is a huge a big favor for a fan according to what is being posted on social media right now um somebody came out to say visit the airport today one day myself go jackpot that is uh, somebody posted that a lot of lagos posted that and then tenny was quick to reply and said if you get passport you won't go to dubai uh tenny actually asked a question and the person said yes and tenny said pick one person you want to go with let me know when you are ready tickets hotel feeding and shopping on me that is what is now trending on social media i think that is a big favor for a fan out there uh, what is your own take about the story coming in from regina downers is another big coast uh, regina downer posting a picture of her you know uh <laughs> behind her barbaros uh, that was bought for her by you know network billionaire network uh, she captioned the post i was created to live soft life i am not built for stress you know baby girl for life that is coming in from uh, regina daniels at a point like this and um, people are now responding to that on social media yes guys you need to understand that man nobody is created for a kind of stressful life a broke life and the rest is what uh, our beliefs our faith and uh, our society has actually brought to us that is something you need to understand about the whole life we are now living and i think uh, young ladies you don't need to be pressured into like desperation like what we're hearing about like lucky girls and the ogs that is something uh, happening on social media right now before i jump off finally i want to take out this time to really appreciate you guys for watching my videos and sharing them across social media platforms if you are new here take out time click the subscribe button below the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos i love you guys keep supporting through as keep sharing my videos and keep being a part of this interesting and great channel you can go and check me out on other social media platforms and then join the interactions like usual